Welcome to step number two of the trilogy series of videos on how to get started as a Weber State concurrent enrollment student. After you apply and are accepted to the university, you'll need to go in and change your username and password. To do that, you'll go to portalapps.weber.edu slash getwcid. Then you'll fill in your birth date. Please pay attention to the format listed on the website. After that, you'll enter your social security number. Please make sure that your social security number matches the social security number that you put on the application. After that, you'll hit continue and move forward. You'll get a temporary password. You'll want to copy this. After that, you can hit continue. From there, you'll be asked to put in your username. Your username is your first and last name. After that, you'll click paste and put the current temporary password and then hit login. From there, you'll want to change password. My new password will be put in after I show the password. This is a helpful hint and tip that can help you know what you're putting to make sure it matches what you want. I'm going to go with Weber Hoops 2013 as my new password. After confirming the password, I'm going to change the password. I've now gotten a notice that my password has been changed successfully. Now that it's been changed successfully, I can go into the FlexReg system and register for concurrent enrollment courses.